I already have made a video on VST to RTAS adapter, making another one. This one's gonna be very quick. Now, some people are having issues when they load their plugins into Pro Tools, Pro Tools automatically crashes. Now, here's what you have to do. You have to open VST to RTAS adapter. You're gonna go to tools. You're gonna remove all wrappers. The reason we're gonna remove all the plugins, we're gonna check to see if there's another problem. Sometimes I've seen VSTs that are corrupted and automatically crashes Pro Tools. Now, what you wanna do, you wanna go to your VST folder in my case is C VST. So I'm gonna go into that folder and I only have two VST plugins. So somewhere on your desktop, I wanna create a folder, call it backup. You wanna highlight all your VST plugins, Control A, it's gonna select them all and you're just gonna to wanna to drag them there. So now once you downloaded the plugin, you put it in your default folder or whatever custom folder you created. You're gonna go to tools, detect new VST plugins. So it found my plugins. And then once you're done, detect and wrap VST plugins. There we go, now you can close it. Now one thing that I have to tell you, I said it in my other videos, always right click, run as administrator. So the next step will be launch Pro Tools. All right guys, here we go. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna create a new session. And I'm gonna call it test VST. Here we go. In search, you're gonna go to plugins, wrapped plugins, select the plugin. And there we go. Over here we have tune it. It allows you to tune your instrument. We're not gonna test it, but you can see that the plugin does work. Here's what you have to do: you have to close Pro Tools. Go to your default or custom folder where your VSTs are in. Get rid of everything in here. What you're gonna have to do, you're gonna have to go to your backup folder where we put all the VSTs and you're gonna have to try one by one and wrap each one of them and see if it crashes, if it loads. That way you can find out which plugin is crashing your system. I've seen it happen, I've done it, until you find that one plugin that's completely causing your system to crash. But anyway guys, this is Ray, hope you enjoyed. If you have a question, post in the bottom rate the video and remember guys check the sub bar the link is going to be there subscribe later guys